And so begins the dropout arc. At least I'm coining it that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Boss or I Shinobi. We have episode 132 of our MHA watch today called Full Power with two exclamation marks. Last episode, like I said, Deku left UA high. Very big deal because that was the entire show. It was him wanting to be a, a hero in the first place. And the fact that we've come so far with this character that he felt in this, this necessity to leave shows just how bad things have gotten. We're going to hop right into it, see what's in store. If you're new to the channel, drop us up and hit that big boy bell and let's get started. A jailbreaker? God, the city's just like abandoned too. Who are these two heroes? Oh, thank you, Shindo. Grand, that's a cool name. I don't think we've ever seen either of them. Hero named Turtleneck? Are they about to die? I have a bad feeling. He kind of looks like Deku. I wonder why I introduced them. Seems like we're cutting away. We are. Wait, what? Okay. Oh, no, here we go. Go away. Ketsubutsu Academy. Oh, they're so nice. They don't trust the heroes anymore. Yeah. Oh, man. They don't want them. Dude, what a, what a, sh like a culture shift. Yeah, they won't be able to stop a Nomu. Or, yeah, a Jailbreaker. Some of those actually in prison. Mm -hmm. That's sad that it's gone to the point where they can't trust the heroes, though. They're, they're not going to budge, I guarantee it. Yeah, they don't trust that bright smile anymore. Oh, that group is going to die as soon as they leave. Vibrate? That's his power? He? Who? Was that the building? Oh, was that the building they were in? Oh my gosh. Dude, it's huge. <gasps> Muscular. Oh no, you're so dead. Oh, you're so dead. Oh, they don't stand a chance. I can't get over how much he looks like Deku. Oh, now they're witnessing. Yeah. Hey, at least they were sticking by the word. They're going to fight. We're trying to. Dang. Yeah, they don't they don't see a hierarchy anymore with heroes. Oh, that guy is so beyond dead. Look at him, man. God, dude, he's so gross. They come flocking. Oh, vibrate. 12,000 layers. Oh, where a man's got to do what a man's got to do. Oh, this guy has such a positive attitude still. That's a weird line. I'm going to be honest. I don't think this is going to work out still, though. Man's just going to grow more muscles. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. Eh? Deku! Oh my god! Dude, Deku looks so menacing! Dude, look at his eyes! I missed you! Oh, this ain't this ain't just Midoriya anymore, man. Dude, if you thought if you thought Deku was strong then. Oh no, he just wanted to flip the building. I love muscular so much as a villain, man. What is this gas he keeps emitting? Is that a new power? Because he has like the danger sense again. Or now he has the danger sense, but this gas is something else. Yeah, but he's alive. Dude, Deku is like Batman now. He just show, pops up from out of nowhere. Is this why he did leave? Just to be this, like, vigilante type? Smokescreen, okay. He's, he's training with it. That's a cool power, though, a smokescreen. Just use them all together. That's true, it's not like an ultimate. A smokescreen is tactile. Tactical? Oh, there's gonna be a nutty rematch. Six. It's cool seeing him use them all together. Oh, there he is! Danger sense! Muscular don't know what he's got in the arsenal now. Look at him float down, bro! Dude, Deku is, like, terrifying! What's 
what happened to that young bright-eyed boy? Say his name. Oh, that's gonna piss him off. What a shot. Blood in battle. Like, feels bad for him, yeah. Dude, whatever happened to this kid? Wasn't he like Koda or Kota? What Koda is the one is the student that can talk to animals. Watch Deku just one shot him. Oh, wait, what? Ugh. Oh, it's so gross, man. Oh, so it wasn't just to pick up the building. He was actually in pain, or he's suffering. Oh my god, he is gonna one shot him. 45% impact. Damn, he's so clean with it now. 45% is his full power? Wait, wait, bro rolled him before the eye catcher? Batman Deku is a menace. Boomerang, man. Mr. Smith? What kind of hero name is Mr. Smith? Look at him go! Is Deku gonna start doing that thing where he just like pops up randomly in different places? Enters conversations midway. Yeah, he just didn't want a hero's help. He still has a heart. He's becoming sort of a symbol of peace in his own way, though. Like in a new way. Not your your uh, orthodox symbol of peace. Iron Maidens? Oh, for him to be- wait, like an actual Iron Maiden? And then he just dips. Uh, it feels like such a different show. I feel like the sky should be gray to, to match the mood. It feels like a gray sky mood, to be honest. Is that the Batmobile? Kiggle. Oh, my kind of like training him. Uh. Oh, interesting. That could be really helpful. That's why I did 45%. Before your rematch. This is all building up to him seeing Shigaraki again. Phone call is here. My goodness. Was uh, they just all both all taken down people? They're all trying to just slowly take people down. I love the scar. It's gnarly. Intercepted and isolated. Gotta catch him off guard. Mm, true. But when are you actually ready is the question. They'll never be completely ready, I don't think. Mm. So he can withstand more, but his body is still damaged. I figured they had to let his mom in on, on what's going on, too. Okay, so this is where he made the decision. He's worried about them. If you bust the wall down right now, I wouldn't be shocked. Dude, this season, I can feel it, is going to end right before the rematch, too. And next season is going to be just a, a sicko mode. Because she knows it's just beginning. Yeah. God, what a twisted fate. Damn, what a flashback. Absolutely. He's coming with them, yeah. If Deku's not gonna listen to him, he's not gonna listen to Deku. Who's he talking to? Oh, genius. He's got new jeans on. They're like bright blue. I like these three as a team. It's cool. He holds it so... Why does he hold it like that? Gran Torino. Dang, dude. Oh my gosh. Wow. The passing of the garb. Holy. Oh my gosh. What a squad. It's like the Avengers. Bro, all might just like the uh, the analytical one.
You what? Oh my gosh, dude. This season just doesn't slow down. We had that entire basically war and yeah, we had like an episode or two where we got, the, you know, backstory and stuff like that. But I mean, this entire, I guess, sort of arc kicking off with Deku not being in UA is, is starting fast. He had a rematch with Muscular for God's sake. The Muscular is like the main villain of, what was it, season two? And it, it took part in like half of an episode. It just shows how far Deku has come and how much he has in his arsenal now, all the abilities he has and i liked that line especially from the, the previous holder where he said like don't think of them as just like big attacks like ultimates you have to use them together as as tools which with the smoke screen it really does feel like that but I, I, like i said i like this uh this sort of uh vibe with the the five of them together because we've seen all of them go all out to an extent so now it's all of them at their full power together working towards that rematch with shigaraki which like i said i feel like it's gonna basically be starting at the end of the season and we're just gonna have to wait for it but guys that's been it for episode 132 of our mha watch through drop a sub if you are new and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace